Now, if you want to become a Pepe millionaire, you're going to need 6.837 billion Pepe. And I'm sure you're wondering, how did I come up with that number? Let's dive into how I got that number and why that number is so important. Now, I want to know what happens if you buy Pepe right now. Let's say Pepe goes up from this about $570 million market cap, goes up towards the current price of Dogecoin, about $10 billion market cap, or Shiba Inu even, about $5 billion market cap. What would be your value gain? How much would you have to invest to become a millionaire? You can see that if we went to the Dogecoin current market cap, you'd be looking at a gain about 1,600%, basically a 16x returns, absolutely massive gains right there. We went to Shiba Inu about that 5 billion threshold, you'd be looking at about 700% returns, roughly a 7x return. And so if you wanted to basically turn some value into a million dollar portfolio, when we go up to Dogecoin, for example, you still be needing to invest like $70,000, a serious amount of cash, potentially become a millionaire. That's just not accessible for a lot of people. So an alternative way to look at this, what happens if we go to the all-time highs of Dogecoin and Shiba Inu? When we take a look at that, you can see Dogecoin all-time high, just shy of $90 billion. Shiba Inu all-time high came in just about $43 billion. So absolutely massive difference compared to these current values. And so what happens if let's say you invest in Pepe right now, and then we go to the all time high of Dogecoin, of course, that's not gonna be easy by any means. But the reason why we're looking at this is that this is a threshold, the high end threshold of what has a meme coin done before. We can look at this and there's actually precedent of this happening. This is not saying that Pepe is gonna go to a, you know, $1 trillion market cap or something like that. This is an actual concrete number. Let's look at what would happen if we made that happen. So if we went to the all time highs of Dogecoin, again, just shy of a $90 billion market cap, you'd be looking at Pepe basically 1,000 or 15,000% gains. Absolutely massive gains, basically 155 X returns. Insane. This is gains that you don't see normally for like 50 plus years in the stock market, if that. Like absolutely insane gains as a relative scale here. And if we went to Shiba Inu all time high, you're looking at 7,400% gains, basically 74x potential right here. So again, massive gains. Now, what would happen if you went ahead and invested, let's say $100, $500, $1,000, and we made this happen? And of course, there's things that we have to do to make this possible. And we're going to talk about that in just a second. But first of all, let's look what happens if you invest just $100. You invested $100 into Pepe right now, and we go to the peak of Dogecoin right now, you'd be looking at getting $1,600. Really nice gains for a $100 investment. That's insane potential right there. If we went to Dogecoin all-time highs, you'd be looking at $15,000. Let's say you went ahead and took $1,000, you'd be getting $16,000 at the current price of Dogecoin, or $155,000 at Dogecoin all-time highs. You can basically turn $1,000 into Lambo money. Now, it's not going to be the nicest Lambo out there, but you could get a used Lambo with that kind of money, which is insane. If you think about it, $1,000, a lot of people could do $1,000. Now, let's say you stretched a little bit and you went for $10,000 into Pepe right now. If we went to Dogecoin peaks or Dogecoin current price, you'd be looking at $160,000. We went to Dogecoin all-time highs, you'd be looking at $1.5 million. You'd literally become a millionaire off of a $10,000 investment into Pepe if we went to Dogecoin all-time highs. Now, the question is, how do we make that happen? Before we answer that question, make sure you guys subscribe down below and hit the notification bell to get notified as soon as videos like this go live. Now, if we wanted to hit the Dogecoin all-time highs. There's a couple things that we need to make happen. First of all, we need to get some mainstream attention. We're not going to be able to make that happen with just a couple holders. You guys can see right now with Pepe, if we open it up on Etherscan, Pepe right now about 116,000 holders. That's not going to get us there. We need millions of holders of Pepe if we want to see that become possible. We also need some good news events. You guys can see right now, Pepe, since it peaked out over here, we've had the price decline. We have seen some nice consolidation where the price of Pepe is trending within these different channels right here. But what we need to see is some major news event that's going to cause the price of Pepe to just explode and go up. And that's not unrealistic. We could see some news events come out that push Pepe back to all-time highs. But if we wanted to go and have Pepe go up to Dogecoin all-time highs up at a $90 billion market cap, essentially, there's a lot of things that have to go right. And if you want to learn more about those different things that we'd have to have happen to make that possible, check out this video up here, and I'll catch you on the next one.